Hi guys, it's Nancy. It is Monday, August 10th, and this video is for week 13 and 14. I didn't do a video last week. Um, I should say I didn't post a video last week because I did it, and after I watched it, I realized how boring it was. It, it was, you know, nothing it. Um, sorry, my son's talking to me. Um, so anyway, today I weigh 235. That is a loss of five pounds from last week. I've been doing some big time walking in the evening. Um, I find it really enjoyable. It's actually, I found a path by my house. I've lived here two years and didn't know it was there, but it's, it's beautiful out, um, through a little bit of some wooded area. And, uh, so it's real nice. It, it's about a 45 minute walk from start to finish on the trail. So, um, just want to say real quick before I forget, my sister has, um, uh, is doing postings now. So if you're interested in watching someone else and supporting her, her name on here is Buns, B is in boy, U-N-Z, 1969. So check her out. That's my sister in Little Rock, Arkansas. She had the lap band, gastric bypass, no, it's not gastric bypass, lap band laparoscopic surgery. So, um, you know, different than me, but um, good luck to you, Amy. I, I, I hope you're doing well, and I hope everything's going good for you. And, um, you know, I, I, you'll do great. I know you will. She's just past the liquid part. Uh, one of her emails, she was talking about how she's concerned what to eat, and I remember that. Um, I am excited to say I pretty much eat anything. I mean, I don't eat sugar. I avoid sugars. Um, I don't enjoy any. I don't. In, I don't know the word. I, I don't. I don't eat sweets. No sweets, no ice cream, no cake, none, none of that stuff. I've occasionally had a few chips. Um, did make me sick, but obviously I, I didn't overdo it. I um, pretty much follow the rules that they want you to. There's a play in here. Um, six meals a day. Usually I do five. I, I, I find it difficult to get a sixth meal in at the end of the day. I have seen my appetite increase a little bit. Um, so I, I eat a little bit more protein. Oh my gosh, sorry. It's a fly. Um, so it, it just, right away when I sit down to eat a meal, I, I have a little bit more protein instead of the one to two ounces, I'm now having three to four ounces of a protein followed by fruit or vegetable, followed by a starch if I'm still hungry. Um, it's so funny how I used to be an afternoon eater and then an evening eater and now after dinner, I can't eat anything. It's once I've had dinner, I'm pretty much done. Um, so this Friday, I'm going to Six Flags again with some friends. Um, it'll be fun to see if my body's changed at all since the last time that I went in July. Um, ride those same rides. I'm, I'm down... Maybe 10. I know at least 8 pounds since I went. So um, that would be interesting. I did some shopping this weekend. It was fun. I went to Goodwill. And I, first of all, you have to have patience to go to Goodwill. I don't have patience, especially when it comes to shopping. Like, I want to walk into a store and go, oh, I like that outfit on the wall. Get it in my size. Oh, I like that outfit on the wall. Get it in my size. No, uh, and and as I get thinner, um, styles are styles are very different from when I was in college and high school and wearing smaller sizes. I was always big, but I, I still kind of shopped in style. But as I've been an adult, basically it's you know what looks good on a big girl. That's that's what I would look for in stores. Um, being so tall and heavy. I, and and why they always had stripes that went across your body, I'll never understand. But um, so anyway, it was pretty much I would buy what Catherine's had. I always liked Catherine's because the sizes were big there. 
Um, I liked other stores like um, something barn. Where is my brain? I can't think today at all. Um, but the clothes in there were ran small. So Catherine's was always my favorite place to go. So anyway, I went to Goodwill and I bought two pairs of capris, a black pair and a khaki pair, size 18. And I thought, I'm not going to try them on because they're not going to fit. Um, but I'll, I will get into them eventually. And so I brought them home and, and I tried them on and I could get them on. I could get them zipped. Now they're tight. Um, and I don't know that I would wear them out in public, but, um, I was, I was pleasantly surprised with them. So, um, so yeah, I, I'm pretty much on the verge of a size 18. And this is coming from someone who was on the verge of a size 30. I never bought any pants in a size 30, but I was wearing tw 28 jeans and they were tight. I would like after lunch, forget it. I couldn't breathe. I had to unbutton my button at my desk, top, but you know, my pants button and hide miserably because I didn't want to stand up because my pants were undone. So yeah, I am, I am squeezing into an 18 again, not really ready to fully wear it out in public, but I got rid of, um, some more of my clothes today. I passed them on to a coworker, um, a bunch of size 24s that I had that are way too baggy on me. And um, I found a couple capris in my basement. Who would have thought to go look at my own basement? But I had some clothes that I had once packed away and said, I will get back into these. Well, it took surgery, but I'm back into them. Size 20, a couple pairs of capris. So I found those and got into those. And I'm excited. I'm happy. It's it's so exciting to finally start seeing the benefit of, of all of my hard work. So again, working out regularly. I didn't go today. Um, no excuses. I just was lazy and I will be back at the gym tomorrow. Definitely. So that's about it guys. Pretty boring. You know, I know I said I do a video every week, but when life is pretty uneventful, I don't want to bore anybody. So I don't know. Send me questions. I uh, just want to say thanks for the support. Oh, I almost forgot. Last Thursday, I saw my surgeon for the three-month follow-up. And according to their scales, which are different than mine, have always been different numbers. But according to my weight at the pre-op appointment and my weight at the three-month checkup post-op, I have lost 69 pounds on their scale. And the surgeon said that for someone who's three months out, I am way ahead of the curve. I am doing excellent. And he he has no doubt in his mind that I am doing so well because of exercise, flat out. Going to the gym four to five days a week, exercising four to five days a week is the key. And that is why I have been so successful. So just some, you know, words to put out there, guys. I, I, I hate it. I hate every moment of it. I don't look forward to it. I don't feel good afterwards. I mean, I feel good in the sense that, thank God, I am done for another day. But... I don't know. I'm not, I'm not there yet. I don't get that high that they talk about. Never did. I don't know if I will, but anyway, um, it's obviously what works. So anyway, um, thanks for the support on my last video. A lot of, uh, a lot of congratulations on the 60 pounds loss. So thank you to all of you. And again, check out my sister Amy's website, buns, B U N Z 1969. And by the way, Amy, what is the buns? I, I don't, never asked you. Where's that from? So, love you, Amy. And to the rest of you guys, have a good week. Take it easy. Bye.